everybody, Zeus McClurkin here of the world famous Harlem Globetrotters. Today, I'm at the Oregon Zoo. I heard that there's a sea otter that actually knows how to slam dunk the basketball. Let's find out. Come on in here with me today. Let's go. Juno, here you go. Hey. Hey. That's an assist. Oh, That's an assist. I might got a new teammate here. The reason we started basketball here was we trained Eddie because um, just with mobility, he was older, so we were like, okay, this would help with maybe arthritis or just movement in your body more and things like that. And then when he passed away, and so we're not doing it, we don't play basketball with Juno for anything medical, it's just more for fun. But as she ages, it might help her just, you know, mobility in her shoulders and arms and things like that as she gets older. <laughs> Juno, bring! Oregon Zoo, trick shot. I just got a pass from my eye. Oh, no! <laughs> what you think of that, Juno? Sometimes she takes it off, sometimes she doesn't. It's her choice. These guys eat an enormous amount of food every day. So she weighs about 40 pounds and she'll eat about 25% of her body weight in food every day. Can you go, sweetie? So, oh, sorry. And, no. and good quality seafood for her. Yeah, I see. It's not time. Right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Messi's falling at home. Oh, yeah. They are incredible eaters. You, all, you know there's a problem when an otter doesn't eat. Yeah. Like if they're not eating, you're like, okay, something's going on. Yep, yep. Here you go. Juno. I just want to say a huge thank you to the Oregon Zoo and Juno for letting us come over here today and play some basketball with us. Now, if you guys want to see even more amazing basketball, make sure you come out to one of our games. We're going to be playing at the Moda Center on February 8th, 2 o'clock and 7 o'clock. Go to HarlemGlobeChowders.com and get your tickets today.